thank you very much. And now to former chairman of the Democratic National Committee and former governor of Pennsylvania and NBC News political analyst Ed Rendell. He is supporting Hillary Clinton for president. So I would I I guess Ed thinks Bernie Sanders should back down. So too. Ed, do you think Bernie Sanders should back down, or does he have the right to keep fighting just as hard as he wants to in this democratic process all the way to the convention? Oh, he absolutely has the right to fight in any way he wants. Uh, he's earned that right. He's done a great job bringing new people into the party. He's focused the national attention on issues that we should be concentrating on. So he has every right to do what he wants to do. But I would appeal to Senator Sanders if I could talk to him, assuming Hillary Clinton has a good day today, and say, look, keep fighting. Keep talking about the things you want to get done. Keep talking about the issue differences you have with Secretary Clinton. Keep talking about all that stuff, but don't start attacking her judgment. Don't start attacking her character. Don't start attacking the, the vote in, a, in Iraq. That was a long time ago. Just concentrate on the issue differences. Be strong, be vigorous, go all the way to the convention. Not only try to win those issue battles in, in the platform committee, but I think Bernie Sanders has an enormous opportunity to reshape politics in this country. He should take his pack and transform it in, into his election pack, transform it into an issues pack, and support progressive candidates right. going forward, not just in November, but okay. for years to come, because he can raise money and be a dominant force in democratic politics Mark and maybe in politics in America. Governor, if it was Hillary Clinton versus Donald Trump, 